Hello, my name is Michelle and this is Abby. Hi. Welcome back to my channel. It's a little windy out here, but it's a wonderful Saturday afternoon. It's a little cold, it's a little windy, but I thought I'd share with you guys what we are doing today. We are basically strengthening the crate, adding value to the crate, making sure she's comfortable in there. And we're gonna utilize it to like teach some impulse control how to behave to gain access to things and um, increasing the stay and hopefully the recall. So I just wanted to share with you guys today and um, yeah, hope you guys enjoy. We are here in a tennis court, fully enclosed. I have the crate set up over here with her bed and I'm gonna run you through some drills with her. Basically, I'm gonna start from the beginning with you guys, how to introduce the crate. I don't think I shared that with you all, but I'm gonna start from ground one. You'll see what I do. I'm gonna treat her for showing interest in the crate, getting in the crate, and then yeah, we'll play some games. So as you can see, she's not a, a huge fan of the crate. Sometimes she would go in there and she wouldn't even want to eat. So that's why we're doing this activity now. That can happen sometimes if you move too quickly when introducing your dog to the crate. For example, when you have to go to work and you don't want to leave them unsupervised, but you're going to be gone for three, four, five, six, seven, eight hours. If you don't have a good strategy to make sure you know the dog is not in the crate for hours at a time, the dog can develop some hesitancy and not enjoy their crate as much. So we're trying to build the value in the crate. Um, it is dinner time, so she's a little bit more motivated. And that's why we're working with the crate today. And yeah, so we're gonna try to play some games now that we've done the initial groundwork of her going in the crate and being released to come out the crate.
So that last series, basically you saw me being a little childish, you know, just having some energy, seeing if I could get the dog to break her crate. What I mean by that is exit the crate without the release word. He saw me saying quite a few different terms, applesauce, dropping things. She broke one time with the leaf blew by. So I started to incorporate um, toys, see if she would break if I threw a toy or dropped it or if I bounced or said a word that wasn't the release word. So right now I'm proofing the crate just like I proofed to stay a couple while a couple of weeks ago. Um, we're proofing the crate. When she's in the crate, she doesn't leave the crate until I give her her release word, which is okay. Um, so now we're just last session is gonna be um, we're gonna increase include her like place. I'm gonna teach that. I don't think I've taught the place per man in a while, not since he's been in the van, and definitely not in an environment like this. So I'll show you guys how I teach the place, which is her bed. I'm gonna use the word place. And then we're gonna play a game of crate, place, sit, down, whatever we can do, just so you know, to see if she's listening to me and paying attention, basically making her commands more reliable. Always making it fun for her. We're gonna play some tug, have some treats, and you know, enjoy herself. Yes, good girl. Okay. Yes, good girl. Oh yeah, who's a good girl?
Girl, yes. Good. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Good girl. So we played a little games there. We did a little back and forth between the crate, the, 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 the bed. Wow, I can't speak. A couple of obedience cues. I'm gonna give her a few minutes break. We're gonna play around. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, we will see you guys next time. Leave a comment below, so like, subscribe. If you like this video, leave a poodle emoji in the, um, in the comments below if you got to the end of the video. And if you have any suggestions or things you want to see, just let me know in the comments. I'll try to get back to you and maybe I'll make a video about that thing. See you next time. Bye.